Do you want to ask me what gets me mad? And I'll tell you what gets me mad. And that is the RoboCop remake uh, this year. Yeah. So anyways, let's get to it. What the hell are they thinking, man? Seriously? I mean, you got a week from now. When is the release day that they're going to release it? And of course that they're going to release it on Wednesday. And that just tells me straight up that they don't fucking believe in their movie. Because they would release it on a Friday. But a Wednesday? Are you fucking serious, dude? That's just telling me something right there that you don't really believe in your movie. Columbia and MGM. And I said it. I guess because they feel that this is going to be epic fail and epic uh, flop. Which, bravo, they seen the light. Bravo, bravo to MGM and Columbia Pictures. <sighs> yeah, Joe Kidman is not going to do shit. His, his acting performance is going to be terrible. Because always and will stay is Peter Weller. Hell fucking yeah, dog. Peter Weller is Robocop. Okay, just how like Robert England is Freddy Krueger and Michael Keaton is Batman and things like that. Okay? Now, of course that this movie is not going to be anything like this classic right here. This good movie that you could just you just love and you care for, okay? Because you do love and care for it, okay? But you take something that's good, you hit it over the head with a hammer. Let's just use this Gizmo doll, for example. Gizmo was lovable and cute. And Gremlins, and he was awesome in Gremlins too. Okay, as he did the Gizmo Rambo thing, and shot the arrow into the Spider Gremlin. But let's just take this hammer, okay, and you hit the Gizmo hard into the head. Then it starts acting fucked up and crazy, okay, as it starts jerking off and swinging its head like this and making sounds. Yeah, how stupid is that? Yeah, so basically what they what they did was they took Robocop, they hit him on the head, and then there we go. We got a fucking remake now. We got a fucking remake. Yeah. It just gets me pissed off because we all know that Joe Kitterman is going to suck. Uh, that actress is going to suck. Okay, maybe Samuel Jackson will give a decent performance, but he's in a shitty movie, okay? And Michael Keaton is washed up now. What was the last movie that he was in? And that last movie, even though I like it, was The Other Guys. And he was terrible in that, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to be honest with you, I'm going to tell you the truth. He was terrible as that. He, he was playing the same person... That he's going to play in this fucking RoboCop remake movie. So, yeah. I think Michael Keaton will probably give an okay performance. Maybe. Maybe. Okay, but he's in a shit movie. Like I was saying that Samuel Jackson is in a shit movie. Also, Gary Oldman is in it. And Gary Oldman is in a shit fucking movie. I mean, when is Gary Oldman going to get good work again? Seriously, I did not like him in the Book of Eli, and I did not like him in the three Batman movies. Okay, I did not like him in the three uh, Christopher Nolan films. I'm just saying, though, Gary Oldman needs to get fucking better work. But I am getting off topic. Let me get back on topic. Well, I know that 
the film is going to be an epic fail. I know that it's going to be a, a box office flop. Or it could do a 180 and be a box office success, which I don't really understand. Because you're going to have the dumb de demographic going to see it as they get hit in the head with a hammer. And they're going to really enjoy the shit. And they're going to be doing this. Yeah, they're going to be doing that just like how Gizmo is doing that right now. And they're going to praise the shit out of it. You know they are. They are going to praise the shit out of it and say, Oh, well, this old RoboCop movie sucked this. It sucked this, and the, and the remake is better. The remake is better. And we're going to pitch it and kick it and all that shit. Fuck you guys. Seriously. Fuck you. And you know what else? You should not let your kids go see this movie. You want to know why? Because you could set them down and let them watch this movie. Or this movie. Yeah. You could let them watch both of these. But make sure it's the TV version. Because this has a lot of gore and violence in it. And cussing in it too. So make sure that it's the TV edited version. If you're going to let your kids watch it. Just saying though. But. The movie is going to have terrible CGI. Come on people. We all know it. It's going to have CGI like a PS1 game. Or a PS2 game. Like if I wanted to go. See cutscenes for PS1. I'll go and type it in right now. I'll type in. Uh, what was the worst of game? Well, I don't know. Anything. Anything. Probably that Hellboy game that was on the PS1. I'll type in that and I'll see cutscenes for that and it looks like terrible horse shit. If I wanted to see that, I'll go look at PS1 cutscenes, but no, I don't want to look at that, okay? What I want to look at is good practical effects and good stop motion effects that Ed 209 had. Okay, what is this Ed 209 gonna have? CGI shit. Okay, it's gonna look too fake and it's gonna look too corny. Okay. And the themes of the movie. Yeah, he gets blown up and then he gets turned into a machine. Okay. Whereas in this movie, he gets shot up and then turned into a machine. Which I find uh, more fucked up and more disturbing than Joe Kitterman getting fucking blown up and getting knocked the fuck out by me. Because he sucks at acting. And what? That he's going to be part man, part machine? Really? That he's going to have a human hand? Okay, a fucking human hand, and then a robotic hand, which doesn't make no sense. Okay, seriously, like, why give him a fucking human hand? Seriously. I mean, we can understand why they gave him his face, okay? I can understand why, okay? Because he still needs that, okay? But did he really need his fucking hand? No, of course not. And the, this movie is not going to touch upon the things that these two movies did. Seriously. That these two movies did. Because these two movies will always be a fucking classic. And these two movies will always be in my heart. Whereas in the Robocop shit remake, it will Get a bitch smack from me and it will get knocked the fuck out. Yeah. So. As you can tell, I am really mad about this because these this is my childhood. Okay, this is my childhood. This is what I fucking grew up with. 
and watching this one a lot too. And this is my favorite uh, sequel, to be honest with you. This is my favorite sequel next to Rambo 2, Child's Play 2, Jaws 2, any 2s, okay? Yeah, so let's just hope that this fucking bombs. Let's just hope that this does epic fail. Okay, because nobody wants to see Joe Kitterman suck dick and get fucked in the ass. Okay, literally, getting fucked in the ass. <laughs> I just have to use that gizmo doll one more time. But anyways, I am out. Peace.